open the door with the boot uh, open the door to boot the cat uh, as I went I went out to go get my water and stuff and Scout just Mickey and Rocket are up on the couch no sorry Mickey was looking at Mrs. Gimpy working on her computer and Rocket was sleeping in the living room somewhere and I go walking out there and Rock, uh, Scout's just sitting in the middle of the li living room she's just sitting there I go hey Scout what's up she just looks at me I go get my water come back out and I go you want to leave she meowed at me so I walked to the door and let her out <laughs> not my cat she has no right to be here in air conditioning weather or in air conditioning although air conditioner hasn't come on yet anyway happy Saturday so what are we doing oh that's right we just came here to sell stuff yeah we sold stuff here um Um, we got this uh, cyclotron that's produced more fuel. Oh, we still have an extra pristine nanoforge. We got to plug in somewhere. Got some uh, reflector cores. Weather manipulation core. Even make a uh, da, 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 atmospheric manipulation. Do we need to do that here? That's a uh, work. Oh, this isn't my colony anyway. Okay, so what do we need to do? We've got no colony threats. We're currently at war with the uh, Ludic Church, the Ludic Path, of course, Republic, Independence, and Pirates. So, Republic is too far away right now for us to even care about. Ludic Church, they're troublemakers. They're not that far away. That's where we are. Ludic Church is in this area. That's Ludic Path. Ah, uh, look at all the Ludic Church there. Don't we have a system? A colony and a system with some more of them, though. There we go. So, we have Sindria. Cool. Or actually, Sindria doesn't belong, it doesn't originally belong to Ludic Church. So, we should go take that. Marines. Heavy. Oh, we didn't. We sorry. We left a lot of our stuff over in Rocketville, so we got to pick up some heavy armaments and uh, Marines. Get some here, I think. Have some Marines. Some heavy armaments too. Got those Marines. Those heavy armaments. Black market. So, 1,400 Marines, 232 heavy mission armaments, it's not a lot. Let's go see what they have up there. So, Mandalorians being very supportive of our war effort against uh, the Ludic Church. Not even planets. Parachutes, trade goods. Look, more marines, more heavy armaments. Mm, yeah, not a lot. By supplies, too. We're going to be doing evasions, that kind of thing. Anybody get here? An officer for hire. Don't really need him. What can you do? Energy weapon master. Energy weapons deal to plus 30% uh, more damage at close range. And he's reckless. And we'll hire him. So, you know, I could throw them in there for now. I want my drone to not be reckless, just be aggressive. That'll work. So, we leveled up here in a gunship.
gunnery implants. So, better leading accuracy, more damage range, or more range, and uh, less weapon recoil. Anybody else? Nope. Okay. Okay, now we're going to go head on over to uh, some looted church space. Hello, see, everyone. Them up. My name is Veronica, and welcome to Gimpy's Twitch channel. If you are enjoying what you are watching, please click the follow button in the lower right corner of the video screen. That way, you will be notified by Twitch when Gimpy goes live. You can also follow Gimpy over on Twitter at Gimpy Knee. He tweets out there when he goes live and will more than likely follow you back. Thank you for watching. Yep, they're watching and happy Saturday. Let's just jump out here because they're going to fly us right through this big star. Yeah, it's not a very long trip, is it? Then we'll be able to jump off. Perfect. Ish. Turn our transponder off so it'll be a little less uh, obvious. Not that it matters. Public grade. Uh, threats. So, so the public's going to be raiding one of our systems. Right there. We've got three colonies. How many days? 54. So Citadel, Arcadia, Agrius, and Nomios. Nomios. So. Dun, dun, dun. Those guys. So. Got ground defenses. Megaport. Ground defenses. Military base, so that's a uh, means uh, patrols are flying around and patrol HQ there. So you need a patrol HQ too. 60 days, so it won't be done in time, but might help. So the raiding forces are projected to be fairly strong and likely comprised of two fleets. The raiding forces are superior to the fleets defending the system. So we may have to go down there and help out in about a month or month and a half or so. Anyway, running from our fleet as you should. So what are we doing here? We're gonna to try to take some planets if we can. See what their defenses look like. Uh, let's see. I'm directing. Buttons. And we're okay. Military options, so engage battle station. We will do the do not have any other ships with them, so we'll bring the allegiances in. More guns. So, not the biggest of stations, but not the weakest either. needs a booster. Afterburner, sorry. Afterburners. 
Wow, not even try to shoot that stuff down. Just can't shoot that down. Missile after missile. He's gonna make it. So the fighter's in. We don't need to do that anymore. <laughs> okay, easy enough. As expected. Okay, so we want to orbital bombardment, um, the defenses. So heavy batteries, high command, and Lions Guard HQ. So launch the bombardment. Bring 300 fuel. It's okay. Launch raid. 96% effectiveness. A corrupted nanoforge. Corrupted. Manufactured black box capable of building itself. But corrupted is not the good version. But synchronization core synchron synchron synchrotron. This is for producing more fuel, so we'll take that. And we'll grab some supplies while we're here. Launch. Okay, so last 67 marines. Supplies and a synchrotron, which we get need to plug into our fuel refineries for more fuel production. Okay, anybody here? No, we already looked. So I'm gonna wait a day and see if we can do an invasion. See what they look like. So October 29th, that'll work. So they've got this 26, 33 total, 3300. Mm, it's actually fairly even, except we've got heavy units. Yeah, let's do it. It's only invasion. So 600, 1100. So we want to take out the space spaceport first. So we'll drop everybody down on that. And then we'll move them out after that. Okay, so deploy. Oh, Boo Dog, are you watching? Okay, so landing on the Megaport. This is going to eat up a lot of supplies.
Okay, so. Yeah, everybody's going down to the back of port. Now the question is, do we want to use our... Oh, can use fire support. That'll work. Okay, so fire support uses up uh, 70 fuel. And we'll activate that on the mega port. There we go. So, hurt their defenses a little bit. 9,000 versus 900. We should take that in the day. And up we go. And keep the fleet relatively close to the planet to provide support from the orbit. So that works. Oh, I lost three marines and three heavy. Okay, so... Wow, they didn't give up in one turn. We could split up our forces a little. Go take out these guys. We'll move them to heavy batteries. Move them over to heavy batteries as well. And then we can do some uh, durability, do electronic warfare. So what this does it reduces their combat effectiveness and defense by 70% or something like that. Enter to use that. Eats up a fair amount of supplies. Do that. So just make them all weaker. So. Next day. So we lost three marines and three heavy armaments. We've taken control of the port. And we'll have control of this and no problem. So now we can actually split up some stuff. So, although orbital works. So leave them there. We'll move you guys to refining. You guys to command. Inspire, we can do this once. Oh, we have to wait one more turn for we can use it, though. Ah, dun, 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 dun. It's another loser. Although I put that in my notes. I'm going to do a little experiment on auto banning people who use certain expressions like that moron there. Because it's the same people, because they're using the same expression. Every time. So we're going to do like, try tomorrow starting with that, hopefully. Oops. You need to get up and step away from the computer. That was really bad. No, it wasn't. It just looked like it was bad. Mm -hmm. Okay. Next. And lost four marines this time. But no heavy armament. So we got 700 on 200 there. We got 300 there. We've got still 3,000 at the port. 1,000 there, 2,000 there. Eight hundred. That's gonna be ugly. Although we could move everybody off the board onto that. Oh, we have two units there. That's why. So we can actually still hold the 
Move one unit off to go down there. Move those guys down there. They're on the heavy batteries. Fuel production. So actually we'll have you guys go to fuel production. And then we'll have you guys go down to heavy batteries, right? Is that right? Sorry, overworks. And then we'll have the guys from heavy batteries go to Orbital Works as well. Yeah, and power support's ready. Yeah, we'll put that on to Orbital Works to support that. It only burns up a little bit of fuel. Blew up a few of them, and we shall wait. Five Marines and three heavy armor on that time. So we'll take that soon enough. They went back to the port, so we have to go back there. We took this in one term, so it's not a big deal. So we need to send somebody to Megaport and Heavy Batteries. Take this, no problem. Those guys are already been taken. So, all set. Can inspire. Though our morale is actually okay. So, we're good. Wow, these guys are holding off. You got 18 under there. It's clear. So they're pretty much stuck there. So refining up to the port to help out there. No, sorry, the port. Uh, fuel production. Refining to fuel production. Oh, this is eating up supplies. So. Um, He never takes a chat to see his USS Texas, the last dreadnought afloat that had 100 years old. 108 years old? Why would you want to do that? Anyway, he took the planet. And our growth has gone up. So. So growth admin. So faction size up to 86. Bonus admins five. Next admin at size one hundred. We don't use humans as admins for the most part. Try not to. Anyway, managing the calling. So, so new planet. Take back all our stuff that we put down there. And there's no commerce here, so. That. So it's going to be a while before this place is up and running again, because Mighty T has five turrets. But it's 108 years old. <laughs> it's 
so that makes it what a world war one ship how is it still floating is the question So, over to, oh, we got over to works. So, um, worry about that later for now. So, what do they want? They want fuel here, and they want ore and supplies. How many supplies do we have left? 1500. So, we can give them some fuel to play around with, we can give them some supplies. I'm sure that'd go real quickly. It's docked in some river. Money for the National wow. MS Society for the ninth year in a row here on Twitch. Walk MS 2022 in San Diego is April 23rd, but Mrs. Gimpy, Mickey, Rocket, and Gimpy will be doing private walks in April and May. They are walking one mile for every thousand dollars raised. If you would like to help with a donation, please visit stompingoutms.org. Thank you. Yep, thank you. Happy Saturday. Okay, they want that too, so this will keep everybody happy. Oops. So, they got all the stuff they need currently. Still making metals and transportonics. The megaport is disrupted for only two more days. So that's not too bad. So again, this place to be a military-wise is going to be a while, but. Uh, Everything else will be up and running fairly quickly. So, Omaha Beach, okay. I mean, the USS Constitution is even older and still floating. I know the Constitution is, yeah. Well, the Constitution is what docked over at the. Is it down at the Annapolis or is it actually up in, in Massachusetts? I don't remember where it's docked. Cans need to be high tech. No, but it'd be nice if the all the boilers and stuff inside that thing were still, you know, a little upgraded from World War One. I, <laughs> I would hope. <laughs> oh, probably more than likely. If it was well, definitely if it was World War One, it was more than likely coal. And they may have I would think they probably would have refitted it for World War Two. To like I said, you had to have upgraded it some. I mean it, it's even between World War One and World War Two, you're still talking about thirty years. So that's a long time. <laughs> they had to have done some type of upgrades to its innards. They had to have. Okay, so credits per month. This is just it's a rebellion. Oh, we have to fight the about rebels too. Okay, so com directory. You I can help your rebellion problems. We'll give you more supplies, give you some heavy armaments, and we'll give you some merchants too. Okay, so that's the help with the rebellion for a little while. Okay, so we're looking at a time for the hegemony raid. Oh, sorry, republic raid. Coming from way down there. 44 days still. So we actually have some time to fly around and beat up on stuff in the system. That's not ours. Come on, you pansy. Get Pirates. back in there and fight. A rocky, unstable wolf. What did I just take? Oh, Sindria. Sindria is a... I did not look at it. Sindria is a rocky metallic world. 
I could have swore this was the capital for one of the factions. Pandem, that's ours up there. Full turn, what do you look like? Full turn. Ah, Volturn still has rebellion problems. Shipping disruption. So, trade fleets launched from Voltron have suffered losses, resulting in a temporary accessibility penalty of 1%. Local availability of the commodities has been reduced by trade fleet losses, provided no, provided no further losses occur. Blah stuff. Still rebellion, though. Hmm. So, what kind of hostile fleets do we have flying around is a question. I heard that. So these are the hostile fleets causing trouble. It's little piddly things. So what I should do is bring up a defensive force here to deal with these guys. Okay, special functions. Press the fleet. Invasion. Defense. Defense. Make a nice little 500 strength fleet would be more than enough for the stuff that's happening in this system. 495 is good. Where are we? Sindria. Be the origin. Target is Sindria. There. Yes. So that's going to cost us one hundred ninety-eight thousand. That's good. Create Lucas budget is a uh, two thousand. Okay, we're good. We don't need two. There's our defensive fleet. Thirty-three days until it arrives. So I don't hang around for a while too. Threat. They're actually headed to this. So they're headed down to Acadia. So that's where we're headed next. Check them out. See what's down there. So sadly, no dog camp today because Mrs. Gimpy's not going anywhere. <laughs> so the dogs aren't sleeping where there's weather would normally be for the dog camp. So unfortunately, no dog camp. Mickey's actually in here with me, and Rocket's sleeping on the couch. Are you guys chasing me? You guys are chasing me. Thank you. The aggressors, how many points do we have left? To be gladiators. That. Okay, till they get here. Escort 
him, you escort him, you escort me, and escort him. There. So we have a few fighter squadrons. We have 5, 9, 13, 16, 19. Various mix of bombers and fighters. I'm sure will be fine. It's that time again. Drink some water to keep that brain moist. Just it. Just it. So, kind of over to our right. Wow, you guys are horrible at driving. Let's uh, break from the escorts here. And start throwing out some targets for the fighters. Keep them busy for a little while. Chance of missiles making it through there. Let's see. Send the fighters in. Remember, they started this fight. They started these fights. Doing okay. Yeah, we're doing fine. And they're running. <laughs> they're just running.
fighters are doing stuff up here, it looks like. It's unfortunately out of range of missiles, and there's too much debris for missiles to make it through anyway. And they're running. Can't finish the fight they started. Okay, so those four ran, those two never entered, or four never entered, so second command. And kill all but one tanker. Don't care about that stuff. So again, headed down to our colonies to protect them from the evil republic. Shit. Now I got up. Almost level 40. Now 38. So, eh, it doesn't matter what we get here. We're not going to use any of that stuff, so it doesn't matter. And use some supplies, that's for sure. An officer looks like a gun gun. Now nah, we don't need more officers. Smoke him in the dark corner. In opera, opera to extract the subject of an unjust con confinement on Bill Ryan, like six light years away. 57,000. No. Hiring officer for a word. Disrupt a heavy industry for 60 days at least. Nope. We've got better things to do. These patrol fleets really suck. But we're putting good money into that stuff and it doesn't seem to be working. Still picking that up. That's right, this isn't going to be built in time for the raid. So that's why we're here. Um, up 
to install there. And there. Oh. Autonomous mantle board increases the transplutonic boring for organics production by three units. Oh. Oh, or transplutonic and organics. So this is not the best planet for that because it's only sparse ores. Hello, so we don't everyone. Put that there. My name is Veronica and welcome to Gimpy's Twitch channel. If you are enjoying what you are watching, please click the follow button in the lower right corner of the video screen. That way you will be notified by Twitch when Gimpy goes live. You can also follow Gimpy over on Twitter at Gimpy Nee. He tweets out there when he goes live and will more than likely follow you back. More than likely. Thank you for watching. Not guaranteed, just more than likely. But thank you for watching. Happy Saturday. Okay, so... Frozen world, sure you're fine. Mm -hmm. There, there's a war going on. Officer, again, yeah, don't really need one. Here. Blair, ask the veteran spacer what she's looking at. Yeah, nothing, I'm just reading my mail. I should apologize for misunderstanding by buying her a drink. Look below to survivors of the missile mission, and the officers found something in you know, the data cache, rumors. Blah blah. They feared two hyperspace storms before arriving a distant star system. And they found a planet all shining in red. So this is the red planet. Forgotten blah blah stuff. Where was the system with the red planet? Oh, up there. Twenty-four light years. Oh, Mandalorian planets up there even. <laughs> So, interesting. Interesting. So again, nowhere to sell stuff. Okay, so we're building fuel production. That'll be done in 24 days, roughly. Get a stellar mirror to warm the place up. about it. Okay, so. It's 25 days to kill. They're currently traveling. So, they're already on the way here. It's going to take a little bit of a trip, so I might as well just wait. I was thinking about maybe going down there to intercept them, but unfortunately we have at least three entry points into the system between the gas giant and the two gates, so they can come in any one of those spots. I think we'll go sit over here though. I wish we had better fleets. I mean, we have no fleets, patrol fleets around here for some reason. Is that them? That's no, a convoy. Hey, Hegemony AI expection to Rocketville. Two of them? <laughs> Two of them. There's our little patrol fleet. Not going to stand up too well against what's coming in, more than likely. No, 
cops. It's the same. Came up twice. Okay. Task force is projected to be strong and is likely comprised of two fleets. Compared to the defense, the inspection space forces are superior and ground forces are superior. They're going to show up in 55 days. Let's see if we can get a fleet over to Rocket though. Because the raid that's coming in here is going to be a pain. Because these guys aren't big enough. If we could all get into one fleet, it'd be a different story, but they're not going to. Special functions. Just a fleet. Defense. Origin will be rocket build. Rocket now. Time to arrive at least three weeks, so that's what? Twenty one days? Thirty six days. So they'll get there before the invasion wars or the expedition or was it the inspection force? Could put up two fleets. There. So, Defense of Rockaville will put up two decent sized fleets. 600 points worth, that's. I don't know what kind of ships they're gonna be. the crampiness of our patrol fleets. Typical heavy patrol. It's not very good. It never takes the prioritized stuff. For whatever reason. Soft concussions. And what's the other one? The ones we've been using. those guys in. Try lasers, these are point defense. Put those in there too. Mass driver missile ant launcher. This is the one yeah anti-shields use those. Ion cannons well, actually, those are the 15 pointers. Yeah, not those. <clears throat> Twin long range ion cannons. So sort of it's fun. That kind of ion cannon. Seems to want there. At least a point defense. Uh, these are the ten point ion cannons that are pretty decent. Get the twins for the long range stuff, so that actually works pretty well. Okay, so those are weapons. Ships, this doesn't really change anything. That's an allegiance. So, it's not too bad. 
Still not the stuff I picked out, but... And it changes once you confirm it anyway, because it, I don't think it really matters. Ship hull and weapon quality increased by 38%, by 50%. Reckless officer and ship. So when's it uh, so aggressive? Mix of aggressive and reckless officers and ship com command. Gimpy is raising money for the National MS Society for the ninth ones. year in a row here on Twitch. Walk MS 2022 in San Diego is April 23rd, but Mrs. Gimpy, Mickey, Rocket, and Gimpy will be doing private walks in April and May. They are walking one mile for every thousand dollars raised. If you would like to help with a donation, Please visit stompingoutms.org. Thank you. Yep, thank you. And this makes no sense. <laughs> this makes no sense. I mean, these these are really crappy ships. I don't even know how they fit in here. And there's no way to turn them off. Because even if you do this... Ludic Path. Oh, that's just showing Ludic Path. Use a ship will make it more likely to be used by your faction's fleets. And it's maybe. Anyway. Okay. Okay, so the ray, 21 days. Oh, that's right there, we had colonies being built. That's what we just saw there. Or that this has it hasn't been forty four days yet, has it? Guess not. So what's that actually say? Hmm. So something flashed up on the screen. But something about a colony, but it went by so quick I didn't see it. exactly what it said. Could have swore because we have uh, fleets going out two two colonies to be formed up. Maybe that was just uh, they've launched. Maybe that's about it. Whatever that. So that's why they don't show up as colonies yet. Sir, colony expedition successful. So, so what does that mean? Drive has been successful. Ah, there we go. It's Prav. So, location. What happened to the other colony that was supposed to come out at the same time? Building a spaceport. Build a way station next. Is 
So again, there's another colony in that system. And I wonder why it's not showing up. That one. It's supposed to be a colony too. There we go. <laughs> it's said to be. What's funny is we launched that one first. That's this one was supposed to happen before the other one. So yeah, no big deal. Um, and, let me station there too. And as far as industries go, this is going to be mine. Um, it's going to be mining too, probably. Uh oh. Okay, I might be coming up here in a second. You have to do mining here too. Hazard pay. So that the people get paid more for leaving the other here, so there's an incentive to come here. Unfortunately, Gimpy is a. Uh, Any more advents? Not you. Yeah, we didn't have any administrators in this area. Ah, oh, no, there's a patrol. Three gladiators and some other stuff. A lot of fighters. So that's a good patrol fleet. Not very big, but good enough. That one not so good. That one not so good either. Okay, so. Doc Cam. Mickey's there. Found some trouble. Sort of. Look in this bar. Let's see how long that lasts. Importantly, this one. 11 days until arrival, so that's going to be approximately December 14th. So we'll just speed up time a little. Hold down the left shift key to speed up time. You can see at the top of the screen, it just makes time go by a little faster. Not too much. Defensive forces arrived at Sindria, which was originally mm -hmm. that. Why is that happening? Rebellion at Sindria. Oh, that was the deal with the, the, all the the bad guys floating around in the system. That's what that was there for. Because I didn't want to hang around. Almost time. Spaceport of Prof completed construction. The station has begun. Okay, so readers are currently traveling to the Acadia star system. That's where we are. So they should be getting here any second. Of course, the real question is where are they going to be going in? Careful, they can't pop up behind. What's Mickey doing? He's doing this cute thing he's trying to do. He thinks he's cute and adorable. Here, just a second. Let's see if we can get the camera over this a little bit more.
There he goes. So Mrs. Gimpy thinks that Mickey's got an itch on his face, but he's been doing that since the very first night he they've been with us. Does it all the time. We think it's because he thinks he's adorable when he does it. Which he's right. I mean, it's adorable. Let's see. He's got any bad. Looks like we got some people down here. There they go. So this is the Republic raiding fleet or strike fleet. Crush these guys. And off we go. Aren't your legs getting stiff? You haven't moved in quite a while. Stretch, damn it, you ignorant meatbag. No idea why he does that. <laughs> no idea. And now he's done. And off he goes. Okay. So a little bit of entertainment. Not much. Just a little. Find dog cam for now until he comes back. If he comes back. Something got his attention. Oh, Mrs. Gimpy's out there now. That's why. That's why he got up. I guess a little too short to be or small. Sorry. Okay, let's take out you guys. Oh, my fighters are destroyed. But we're okay. Wow, his missiles did not even make it through. We got so much point defense. It's so crazy. Oh, look, it's a Venator. Just letting my fighters just fly around in defensive mode here. Did we win? Oh, we on the map. Oh, not even halfway across. We're good. All right, with sensor range, can't target them. Oh, 
Rasmus is going after our fighters, you bastard. He's just out of range of missiles now. So much point defense, even as many missiles he has, I can't even get through. Lost your friend. Ah, yeah, yeah, the Venator is still up. Not for long. All alone. You're all alone. And that should be that. So, again, this is uh, their little raiding fleet. One of them. I think there was two of them, right? Okay, pursue. Get away. Loot. Okay, that little group there, we don't have to worry about that because our patrol fleets are better than that thing. Invasion fleet gone? I can't. So I thought it was multiple fleets. Huh. So 24 days till arrival. We can get there in time. Okay, peace between the Republic and the Mandalorians, because we just destroyed their fleet. They have no friends. Peace, should we crush them? Well, if we do peace with them, we can deal with the hegemony. Who are sending their stupid AI inspection stuff. So I want to go for We'll go for peace. Just because it'll don't have to worry about the Republic doing stuff to us while we're dealing with the hegemony. Which is now going up there. Currently traveling there. So, bet we can beat him there. This is our capital. So, off we go. What? I'm trying to jump here. Of course, put us right into a star. Ah, just outside of it. Fly faster. Mm-hmm. 
we jump, we'll probably over jump. So just fly around the clouds. Oh, we have defense fleets here too. I forgot about that. The defense fleets have arrived at Bronkenfeld, so no problem. So, our defense fleets. Large defense fleets got a lot of legions in there. An aggressor. One of the gun. Uh, cruiser sized gunships. What are those round ones are? I don't know what those are. There. So, not too bad on the defense fleets. Not the ships I picked up for this one, but. It's okay. We have a market here now, though, so take advantage of that. So this is all Star Wars stuff. We don't sell this to the market. To run into some more remnants so we can get some more alpha cores. A nice little experience uh, marine force. We have it storage. Oh, sorry, that's what storage is. This is storage. Wow, we got seven grand. Oh, that's right, we put all this stuff in the storage because we couldn't carry it all. When we are doing the hypershot stuff. Oh, I guess stop. So I have to go through and get all this uh, vanilla junk out of here and sell that on the market. Because again, we have to dump all this stuff to make room. I wish there was a way for them to color coordinate stuff based on if it's mod related or not so we could find the stuff faster for selling because again I don't have any need for any of this uh, vanilla technology. I'm not, never going to use it. Of course a lot of the Star Wars stuff I don't need either but So, our wire wings, we may use that. So, well, we probably won't use them, but we could if we wanted to. And again, don't want that one. Torpedoes, those. Mickey's back. In here. Not in the camp, but. Pegasus. I 
Traver. Wow, 60 of those things. Heavy dual turbo laser blueprint. I oh, don't want that out there. <laughs> Definitely don't want some of the stuff out there. is metal though. Although probably should never know when you're gonna run into another uh, power shunt or whatever they are. They call them around the blue giants. Anyway, so that's storage. Market. Sell all this now. You just in, you really shouldn't have to pay taxes on your own market. Just saying. That's the whole point of owning the market, isn't it? So you don't have to pay taxes. Two hundred grand. Too bad. Point seven million total now. Okay. Over here. Officer, we don't need an officer, we need administrators. Go rescue an agent. Nah. Okay. So, boy, this uh, can be in for a surprise. Space forces are outmatched, and as out ground forces, our ground forces are superior. So, they're more. I don't know if they're what they're going to do. What they're going to do? Anyway, twelve days until they get her. I guess I should grab some supplies. So we have them storage. Wow, seven grand. More defense fleets. Oh shit! <laughs> These two right here are big enough to defend against whatever the hegemony is going to send in. Probably one of them can take them out. And they are a match. So we don't have to stay here. We can go into hegemony and start beating up on them. And probably dig that one. So you got planets there. Hmm. Where do you want to go first? Jengala? You take out the independence too. Jungle World. Arid World. Let's go take out the Jungle World. Over in Corvus. Off we go.
mushrooms, probably. That is. Okay, so we're just, uh, let's see. Giving hegemony shit because. Aren't your legs getting stiff? No. You haven't moved in quite a while. I'm good. Stretch, damn it. You ignorant meat bag. But, said we're just going to uh, go take a couple of colonies from them because we can. And to strengthen our position, I guess. Although. We don't want to go in here, it's too far away. That's an independent world, but we're going after Jangala. Military plan for these guys. Um, fight me and pursue them. Second command will take care of them. Oh, one still manages to escape. Let me see my. Pirate attack fleet. Salvage. Salvage. I don't care about recent actions. We want to do calling info. So Jingala. Art activity, radar activity, adequate farmland, plentiful organics. So nice, uh, nice planet for growing food. A star fortress. So, will this have this as a nice little mm -hmm. test for the? Executor, Star Fortress versus Executor. I'm sure it's be fine. No, that's why Mipi was sitting in front of the door. Skimpy was left gone. Anyway. So. Totally a fair fight. Little beam weapons. Get there someday. Okay, we're gonna go up the right side. Give him some uh, broadsiding from our left. 
some more guns of fire on them that way. That was a good place to stop moving. Let's move out a little bit. Ah, oh, you're not dead yet. Better? Almost. here and shoot stuff. right? Looks like it will. Except for the beam lasers, they just destroyed all our fighters. Jerks. Gotta wait until he comes back around. <laughs> go. Enough missiles will fix all problems. Okay, so, ship recovery now. That wasn't difficult at all. Okay, so we want to hold on bombardment. No, that's not bombardment. Go. Tactical bombardment against their stuff. 261 fuel. No problem. Info. So, military base, heavy batteries, and station are all taken out. So, Army, mining, and spaceport. 
Military options. Let's do a raid. What do they have? Nothing great. No supplies. So, no raid them. 99% efficiency. So, I believe we'll be invading. So, then I have a very big defense of 600 militia. Militia, 200 more. Gimpy is raising money for the National MS no Society for the ninth year in a row here on Twitch. Walk MS 2022 in San Diego is April 23rd, but Mrs. Gimpy, Mickey, Rocket, and Gimpy will be doing private walks in April and May. They are walking one mile for every thousand dollars raised. If you would like to help with a donation, please visit stompingoutms.org. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, and happy Saturday. Dun, 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 dun. Batteries. Yeah, we're going to overwhelm these guys. No problem. So we need mining and those guys. Sorry, mining and military base left. Okay, set. And we can do a little bit of uh, abilities here. Electronic warfare screws them all up, so to make it go a little bit faster. Needs up some supplies, but we got plenty. It basically just reduces their defensive strength. So, so now can we take this in a day? So only the spaceport and military base is left. And military base would definitely die today. Spaceport might too. It should. 20 to 1. There we go. Okay, so stuff. Storage. Pick up all our extra stuff that we need. And this spoils the war. Stockpiles, so where they short fuel, supplies, heavy machinery, or sorry, ship hulls. We can't do that much about that. Thus, so fuel and supplies. So, other than being them being short, some. Uh, Drugs, no big deal. Can't do hazard pay. Oh, to maximum size. So, we want to do a way station here. Plug in this. Uh, oh, we already plugged in somewhere. Never mind. Hmm. Got all the organics are producing. That's crazy. That's a lot. No administrators. Okay, so we're gonna actually help them with the little rebellion. Can help you with the rebellion. Supplies, heavy armaments, and guardians. Now, unfortunately, that doesn't show up here anywhere, does it? No. Nope. have no real income in, on this planet for some reason. Look at that later. 
Anyway, so there's that one. Who wants to die next? Well, sorry, who wants to be conquered next? Got plenty of Marines left. Lots of supplies, too. I'll try to say independent world here. Extraction depot, orbital station, that's nothing. Oh, that's right. The, the rebels, the hegemony rebels are here. Check out the independent world, see how they're going. Okay, Sharu, and call the info. A ground, ground defense, so these guys are gonna roll over these guys pretty easy. Oh, they're already engaged? Oh, ally they're allies with pirates? You say so. Oh, no. Independence of the station dominates the orbit. Encounter an ongoing battle. So we can go back. We can rate them, though. 96% efficiency. Take some supplies. Okay, maybe we won't. Not, it's not worth 75. <laughs> It's not worth the effort. Officer, we need admins. Just regular human admins. I'm guessing it's the pirates attacking. Yeah, they're more than likely working together against the station. Do my work for me. Looks like they lost. Let's take the free stuff though. Uh, like me. Okay, military options. And then their friends. We'll just uh, bring in some smaller guys. We should be able to roll them pretty quick. So, just a little bit of automated fight. Oh shit, I forgot there was a station. I'm sure we'll be fine. We're fine. I think the station was probably really beat up from the previous fight, though. Because that went down really quick. And these guys, they're more than likely going to run away. Looks like, looks like what they're, they're trying to do. Yeah, they're running.
Hey bag of water, it is time to take a break. Go stretch your legs. Your next break is in two hours. Didn't we just do this the other day, Mata? Didn't we just do this the other day? <laughs> but anyway, thank you very much for the resub with Prime Gaming for 38 months. Guess what? We just did this the other day. But still do it again. So, Mata. Mickey's and Rockets of Recognition. Each Mickey represents 10 Rockets of Recognition. Of course, Rockets represent one. There we go. So, Bata, thank you very much for the continued support. Much appreciated, of course, and happy Saturday. And we'll take a break after this fight is over, which it basically is. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. okay. So, we're going to uh, invade this when we get back, right? Rocket in here? Yep, he's sleeping. Okay, so this is what the evasion is going to look like. We'll have this no problem. Okay, so I was able to take this one or do this when I get back. So, twice a month, it's, it seems like it. I don't think I get double paid, but <laughs> but it seems like, like you do it and then a week later we do it again. Twitch has got issues. Anyway, I got to take a break. This will be the last break of the stream. And uh, get back. We got about uh, another two hours or so to go, and continue on with the ass kicking of uh, hegemony because we can do that, and the independence as well. Anyway, be back shortly. Thank you very much for watching. Enjoy the dog video.